Did you know the most Instagrammed place in Paris was once a notorious slum? Today we're exploring the picturesque district of Montmartre, but like many places in the French capital, its origins were not so idyllic. In the 1860s, following the annexation of Le Boot, Paris was all of a sudden the focal point of high society, and this didn't bode well for the city's poorer citizens, who were chased out of the centre of Paris and found refuge here, in what would be called the Maquis of Montmartre. The inhabitants of early Montmartre were mainly scrap dealers and scavengers, people living off the recycled detritus of Paris. The original houses were wooden cabins, pieced together from the odds and ends of Paris as junkyards. Some of the houses are even said to be locked with padlocks made from old sardine cans. Though it attracted its fair share of petty thieves and criminals, there was a united and supportive community here that also gave home to artists, writers and musicians, some of them of great repute. It wouldn't last though. At the beginning of the 20th century, developers bought up and stole the land from the Maquis to build luxury villas and art deco style buildings. The final blow would come a few years later, when a fire of dubious origins burned down the last remains of the Maquis de Montmartre.